Hello friends, myself Chirak Balodia. Today I am going to teach you classification of auxiliary memory, topic of computer organization and architecture. First of all, what is memory? Uh, we all know that memory is like RAM, ROM, uh, hard disk, pen drive, memory card that all are memory devices. Now we can see over here definition of the memory. A memory unit is the collection of storage units or devices together. The memory unit store the binary information in the form of bits. Basically two types of memory. Uh, memory divided into two types. First one is volatile and second one is non-volatile. Volatile means it stores the data uh, a temporary basis so it loses its data when power is switched off. Non-volatile means it stores the data permanently so when power is off its data is as it is. It means there is no loss of the data. Types of memory. Uh, there are types of memories primary memory and secondary memory. We all know about that primary and secondary memories. Uh, primary memory like RAM and ROM, it is temporary memory, uh, it, it is uh, volatile memory. Secondary memory is magnetic disk, magnetic tape. Uh, this is non-volatile memory. Uh, primary memory, it is also called temporary or main memory. Also, you can say that it is volatile memory. Secondary memory, it is also called permanent or auxiliary memory. So, it is also called uh, non-volatile memories. Classification of auxiliary memory. This is the detailed classification of auxiliary memory. So you can see over here auxiliary memory divided into total four parts. One is magnetic tape, magnetic disk, optical disk and flash memory. Uh, detailed classification magnetic disk divided into further two parts. Hard disk and floppy disk. Optical disk divided into two parts. CD and DVD. Flash memory divided into further two parts. Pen drive and memory card etc. Now advantages of uh, auxiliary memories, this is non-volatile memory we have already discussed uh, before, uh, reusable so it is permanent memory so you can data anytime whenever you store the data uh, it is not overwritten or deleted by the user so you can access data lifetime, reliable, data is secondary storage is safe because of high physical stability of secondary storage device so data is reliable whenever you take the backup from the data in storage area. Uh, convenience. Convenience means authorized people can locate and access the data quickly anytime from any uh, PC or any computer system. Capacity. Secondary storage can store larger volume of data inside of multiple disks and we already know that pen drive and hard disk is the best example of auxiliary memory. <coughs> Cost. Cost is uh, very less in compare to primary memory. So you can uh, uh, purchase maximum number of bytes in cost this is the memory hierarchy first one is uh, from top to bottom we can say that first one is register memory then second one is cache memory main memory magnetic disk and magnetic tabs main memory is primary memory magnetic disk and magnetic tabs are auxiliary memories uh, uh, we can say that from top to bottom increasing the size of memory register memory is the nearest memory from uh, uh, nearest memory of the uh, processor from bottom to top we can say increasing the speed of memory thank you for watching this video please like share and comment subscribe my channel on youtube chirag balodia press bell icon for get new video notification thank you